This one's called GTOS. It is an extension for GNOME shells. And let me demonstrate it out here. Mm, what up? G edit. So you need some windows or applications open and um after you install the uh, extension, it'll be up top here. You can see that there's a little icon here, right? And the way this works is you have to keep uh, a Windows focus. You can't click on your desktop and then activate it. You have to have a window uh, focus first, and then you can activate it. And when you activate it, you have uh, a selection of, like, I guess how big it is, right? So you, this one is 6x6 six six, all the way to 2x2 two two over here. And then you can select... Uh, you know the section of the the your monitor that you want to tile it to so you click on that and it tiles it um, and you have to do this for other uh, windows you have to click on it first so you can be the focus and then you can do uh, your tiling now this one is um, alright um, I think in the future if they add in like key bindings hot corners with this uh, it can be a solid replacement for um, the comp is grid feature because basically this is what it is here and as far as the other ones in here like four times four or six times six that's like overdoing it you know like real small here which I don't think is any useful I think to just stick to like two by two or three by two or something like that then uh, you know it will make sense right uh, other than that uh, pretty cool you know extension and the way to install this well the easy way to do this is you need Firefox because it doesn't really work with any other browser right now uh, you know Chromium or Chrome doesn't work with this site but yeah go to um, their site it's kinda like um, Firefox extension but this is like no shells extension you know you go to the site and you install it the way that you do this is just that you flip the switch you know from off to on here and then it'll pop up like a little message say you want to install this extension and you do whatever it says and afterwards it'll be up top here and then you can activate it by telling it you know so that's just how that works um, yeah that's it so pretty easy uh, try it out see if you like it uh, pretty decent first release but you know in the future I think it can be a solid replacement for um, the compass grid features which uh, I like using that a lot Anyways, that's it for this one.